Greetings fellow Decepticons, Sandblaster1987 here, and today I will be continuing the American RPM Megazord reviews with the Mark Megazord. This is controlled by the Gold and Silver Rangers, with the Gold Rangers Falcon Copter, the Silver Rangers Tiger Jet, and the remote controlled Whale Bomber, which was actually reverse engineered from a Vengex Virus Doomsday vehicle. As you can see, this set comes with a number 9 Whale engine cell. The, yeah, Tiger Jet engine cell only comes with one of those uh, action figures of the Rangers that transforms into a tire, which I don't have. And the Falcon Copter engine cell comes with the Skyshift Morpher roleplay weapon set. Stay tuned for future reviews to see those. But for the Whale Bomber, you can open this hatch on the underside like so and load the engine cell in like this. Be sure to slide the engine cell all the way into the slot before closing the hatch back up again, otherwise it won't work properly. So, to transform into the Mac Megazord, first of all, bring the whale wings this way, like so. Then tilt the wings upwards and split the tail to become legs using the yeah, tail fin here as feet. Then retract the rotors of the falcon copter so they're in two blade configuration instead of four. Take off the tail, reverse it and reattach it backwards like so. If you can get past the rotors anyway. Then attach to this port here, using the same connector as the yeah, tail spinner and wolf cruiser from the Valve Max Magazord review, link in the description. Then with the Tiger Jet, remove the wings and tail fin section like so, and peg it onto the end of the nose like so. This will become a crossbow arm weapon. Not easy doing this at arm's length, bear with me. Then connect the Tiger Jet onto the other whale bomber wing, like so. Finally, remove the whale head and attach it to the chest like so to reveal the head. I forgot to mention that the whale zord actually does have an opening mouth. And here is the Mac Mega Zord in its completed robot mode. For size comparison, here is Geki Fire, the Japanese version of the Jungle Master Mega Zord from Jungle Fury. and the Zenith Megazord combination from RPM, which I'll show how to combine in a future video. For articulation in this mode, the shoulders can move back and forth, the wings can move up and down, and the yeah, circular connector peg on the yeah, Tiger Jet and Falcon Culture allows for it to swivel forwards like so. Before I leave this review, I forgot to mention that the Whale Bomber actually also has a, yeah, temporary attack burst mode. So, transform this back to the Whale first of all. Now, what you want to do for the attack mode is to splay out the Megazord legs all the way so that these clips here clip into the wings. Like so. Angle the Megazord feet from a tail fin so that they point outwards like so. And flip the whale head upside down. And this is the Whale Bomber Zord in its 10 second attack burst configuration. 
So, that concludes my review of the Mark Megazord. I have been Sandblaster1987. Join me next time when I'll be reviewing the Penny on Max Megazord, the last of the four RPM main Megazord combinations. Until then, till all are one, and may the power protect you, always.